Hi, my name's Oliver, age 24, and I run a YouTube channel called How To Draw Really Good. Um, today I'm going to be showing you how to draw a B-Box Fox to a professional 3D standard. So we're going to start by drawing a vertically stretched oblong for his head, and then doing a smiley shape underneath that for his neck. Alright, now you want to do a downward slope for his shoulder and then slope back up again into his hand. And for his hand, you want to do about six fingers and make them quite pointy because everybody knows that pointy fingers are better for playing Minecraft and Bbox Vox is one of the best Minecraft players there are. Now you want to do the other arm in the same sort of style, but you can make his fingers on this hand even more pointy. I once heard a story that Bbox Vox managed to kill somebody just using his fingers. He kind of like typed into the face and there was nothing left. Now we're going to learn a technique called collaring, which is where you do an inverted rainbow and you put that underneath the neckline for the collar of the t-shirt. Now we're going to start adding some colour, so you want to choose a 3D charcoal grey for the collar and then you want to choose a pale 3D pink colour for the skin because you spent a lot of time indoors playing on Minecraft. Now I know this is looking really professional but it's not quite looking like B-Box yet so we want to go ahead and start doing the face. Now you can use a letter C to do the mouth and then you want to do less detail on the bottom teeth and more detail on the top teeth. And then for the eyes, you want to do a larger eye and then a slightly smaller eye to get a real 3D depth of field effect going on with B-Box's face. Now to get a professional in the head look for your character, you want to choose a darker colour than the skin colour for the inside of the mouth. And then you can go ahead and colour the eyes in white and the teeth in white. Now for the moment you're probably waiting for, the herring technique. You want to kind of style it to match B-Box's hair, so you want to do kind of like a tufty patch in the middle, and then kind of like rectangular combed parts on each side, and then be careful to join them back together so that it doesn't look like he's got any bald spots, because I don't think he does. Now if you watch his videos you'll know that he never wears a plain t-shirt, so you want to go ahead and write something Minecraft related on there. So I'm going to write Minecraft LOL on mine because I feel like that's a t-shirt that he would wear. Now we can do the highly praised eyebrowing technique and kind of do some wiggly up and down direction squiggles horizontally across the image to get some nice eyebrows for B-Box. Now I'm going to turn this from a photorealistic drawing into a comic book version of B-Box by adding a speech bubble. And in there I'm going to write, this is my biome, because that's something that B-Box always says. Now if you're up for a challenge and you're more of a painting master like myself, you might want to add some Minecraft props in there with B-Box. So over the top of one of his hands, you want to draw a large box shape and then two smaller boxes inside and then kind of like a space invader shape for the nose and mouth of the creeper head that he's holding. Now you want to go ahead and choose a 3D charcoal grey for the eyes and mouth and then a 3D green for the head and then it'll look a lot more like a professional creeper that has been impaled upon the spiky fingers of B-Box Vox in a Minecraft rage. Now for the other hand I'm going to do a Minecraft diamond and for that you want to imagine the face of a kangaroo and do the outline of that but instead of colouring it in kangaroo brown, colour it in 3D diamond blue. So yeah, that's pretty much finished, so you can add your name and age on there to make it a professional piece of work. Or, if you're using a professional program like me, you could go back and actually add a blue glow to the diamond to turn it from a 3D drawing into a 4D masterpiece and really make that diamond pop out of the screen. Marvellous. So hopefully that was really useful and you can now draw really good as well. Now to finish with, we're just going to have a quick look at how my previous student, Neef, got along with this tutorial. Oh, Neef. It looks like what he's done is he's done tentacles instead of arms. He's forgotten to do sleeves on the t-shirt. He's done the shield from Zelda. And he's made one of his hands the head of a creeper, which is a little bit weird. And also he's written Total Miner on the t-shirt instead of Minecraft. And he's written Marry Me Notch which is, is the guy that made Minecraft, obviously. Um, he's forgotten to do a chin or a neck, and he's kind of done it all attached in one. And the expression on B-Box Vox's face is, is quite, quite alarming. Yeah, this is, this is very wrong. 
Um, on the screen should be a button to subscribe to Bbox Vox's channel, a button to subscribe to my drawing channel, and then a few of the other drawing tutorials that you will find on there. So yeah, hopefully next time Neef will learn how to draw really good. Thank you.